Good afternoon, Borderland. I'm Stephanie Shields. Thank you for choosing KTSM 9 News at noon. Today is day three of the trial for the man charged with killing Sheriff's Deputy Peter Herrera back in 2019 during a traffic stop. We've already heard from witnesses and seen body and dash cam footage. And KTSM 9 News reporter Skylar Soto is live at the El Paso County Courthouse for us with the latest. Now, Skylar, what was discussed today? Well, Stephanie, court started shortly after 9.30 this morning, and so far we've already heard from three witnesses. The first was an off-duty El Paso Police Department officer who was working at Del Sol when she came into contact with Deputy Herrera's belongings like his duty belt. Now, she knew at that moment when she got the duty belt that it was a law enforcement incident. The second witness was a sheriff deputy who went to the hospital and said, in quote, I saw Pete lying on the stretcher. Now, the second witness also saying she, collect, she collected Deputy Herrera's belongings, like his wallet, boots, duty belt, and uniform. Now, the third witness was a retired Border Patrol agent, Arturo Porras. He was called to the scene as backup, and he said when he got there, he noticed bullet casings on the floor along with a pool of blood. He and other agents then followed a footprint path that led them to a shed where they found a male and a female. Now, court is at recess right now, but as we continue, Continue to learn more updates. We'll bring you the latest in our evening newscast. Live at the County Courthouse, I'm Skylar Soto, KTSM 9 News. Stephanie, back to you. All right, Skylar, thank you.